test shows the flow velocity of the current. We will measure it from two meters. We'll start the stopwatch when it, the uh, piece of rope hits here and we'll stop it when the rope hits here. Okay? Chris? What was that, a song? One second, so that's one second to travel two meters. This test will show the high energy of the of the current. Doing this will throw a large or a large pebble. That's the size of it. Now we will throw it into the current and show that it should hopefully get transported by traction. Quite clearly shows that that pebble of five centimeters was transported by traction. By looking at the shape, overall shape of the current, we can tell it is replicated in the sediment beneath. This tells us that it is a supercritical deposit. By observing the flow regime diagram, we can see that the grain size located here is 1.5 millimeters media and the velocity is two meters per second. Can you point those out? There is the sediment size and there is the velocity. By cross-referencing them we can see that this is beyond the supercritical point and should form antigens. Here we have a, an anti-dune with deposition going upstream and then is eroded flat. This is why anti-dunes are very rarely preserved. 